To understand what is new about the BX13 Micro, you have to look back at the Roland GRGS500, the original 1978 Roland guitar synth system. The GS500 guitar did not have a standard quarter inch output. The guitar signal tapped directly off the humbucker pickup and control voltages generated in the guitar operated voltage controlled amplifiers in the GR500. Later, Roland added a separate passive signal path for a quarter inch output on their guitars. But still, the signal sent down the 24 pin cable is tapped right off the humbucker, so the guitar output is always on maximum. The original Roland BC-13 bus converter, using the maximum guitar signal, offered no way to directly control the guitar volume when connecting vintage 24-pin guitars to the new Roland 13-pin guitar synthesizers, like the Roland GR-50. The BC-13 tried to work around this problem by requiring guitar players to run a second cable from their guitar to the BC-13 to use the guitar's passive volume control, and the BX-13 series of clone converters has included a dedicated volume control just for the guitar signal. The BX-13 Micro takes this problem head on with the most logical solution, including a voltage controlled amplifier inside the BX-13, doing the same job as the voltage controlled amplifiers found inside a Roland GR300 or GR700. And here is an added plus, no loss of tone as you turn the guitar volume down. The advanced VCA design does not roll off tone like a passive volume control. You get the full range of sound at any volume. With an entirely redesigned circuit, the BX13 Micro is the smallest and easiest to operate 24 to 13 pin converter ever built. No levels to adjust, no additional cables, just clean analog processing with no latency. The BX13 Micro was specifically designed and tested with the Roland GR55 in mind. The powerful GR55 has the ability to process up to four sounds at the same time. Two PCM synth tones, Cosm model guitar, and the normal guitar output. Using the BX13 Micro with the GR55 is simple. Filter cutoff, or CV1, generates GK volume commands, and the guitar's mode switch now sends GKS1 and S2 commands. And using the new VCA design, the master volume knob on the guitar controls the volume of the normal guitar sound in the GR55. In the GK setup menu, select GK2A for the pickup type. You will notice that a vintage guitar with the BX13 Micro has a much stronger and more robust output than a modern GK3 pickup. While the GR55 defaults to input settings of 65, using the BX13 Micro you can set levels as low as 20 or even 10. Check out a typical vintage pickup compared to a GK3 pickup. The vintage pickup has 10 times the output level. A stronger source signal means less string crosstalk, better signal to noise ratio, and less makeup gain in the Roland synthesizer. And the BX13 Micro works for vintage basses as well. Just boot the GR55 up into bass mode, select GK2B, and 4 string 3 GK pickup position. Vintage Roland guitars continue to grow in value because they are incredibly well made, versatile, great sounding guitars. And the BX13 Micro makes it easier than ever to connect these highly sought after, premium quality guitars with the latest in cutting edge guitar synthesizer technology.